Hey, good Sunday afternoon to you all. Thought I'd do a quick video. Um, I'm called a bearded Welshman. And probably some of you are wondering if I use beard product. I don't use beard product. And here's why I don't use beard product. So when I first started growing my beard last year, I did a year, took a year to build, to build up my beard. And I shade it down and now I'm almost, <clears throat> I'll be at almost another year. Uh, in about three months, It'll be about a year, and I'm gonna go longer and longer and longer. You can see how nice and shaped the beard is, right? So it's nice and soft. I shampoo it every, you know, every other day, or I use conditioner every other day. It's the only tool I use. The only tool. I don't use beard product in my beard one because I don't like that feeling of what I get feels like something's on my face I'm constantly scratching and itching and brushing I have never found a beard product that works for me that feels natural on my face so that's why I don't use beard product tips for for you that want to grow a long beard long like mine or longer than mine um, patience number one patience number two it is going to itch grab yourself a comb or a brush Every time it itches, just run the brush through like that or run the comb through. Now, there's different stages of beard growth that I've noticed with me. I get to the point where it really itches, so I'm doing a lot of brushing, a lot of combing, a lot of scratching. That's good. It helps uh, motivate the hair follicles and stuff, so you want that. But you don't need to wash your beard every day with the soap because it'll, it'll pull the natural oils off the beard and it'll dry it out and this is nice and soft I washed it this morning hadn't washed it two days prior to that it lays really nice I don't care what I've had product on my face been out in the heat been out in the cold I've had issues I always have to have a brush if I want to keep it looking neat for me it's not about keeping looking neat it's about growing the beard and it looks pretty nice so again I'll, I'll show you from the side Sorry about that. How that looks and how nice that looks in the full color beard. So we're in my makeshift shop. This is what I do. I repurpose furniture on the side. It's what I do for a hobby. Got a couple other projects back here that I got to do um, that I'll be working on too. So um, this is about done. It's almost done. I got to get the hardware for it. Fix the uh, drawer slides and put new ones in it. It's good, good to go. It's solid wood, it's made dovetail. It's really made well, handmade. So, uh, but that's what I do. Anyhow, if you've all often wondered why I call myself the Bearded Welshman and do a lot of pipe videos, music, haven't talked much about beards. I used to use a beard straightener. I look back, I'm embarrassed I even used it. I've tried beard butters, I've tried beard balms, I've tried oils. And it always feels like something's there and I'm constantly like scratching and itching and brushing. It just doesn't feel natural. Here's what I say about beard products. If you want to wear beard products and they work well for you, great. If they don't work for you, you don't need beard, pro beard products to help grow your beard. It's how you eat. It's the genetics. And it's patience. Number one is patience. You have to have patience. Now on occasion I'll come down and I'll trim along the side here. And I'll do this and I'll trim and I'll trim above the lip. Because I don't like to have beard in my mouth as I'm chewing my food. So anyhow, just wanted to do a short clip on that. A short video on why I don't use beard products. Hey, you know, if you want to send me beard products to try and you're watching this, that's fine. I'm willing to try them out. Um, and I have no problem with that. But I'll give an honest review. And if I don't like it, I don't like it. And I'll be honest about it. And I'll tell you why I don't like it. But if it works well, and I'll tell you I'll use it. And I'll use it again. But that's what I, I do. I just, every other day is when I wash the beard. So you want to get that beard nice. Keep it nice and soft. Don't wash it every day. You will dry it out. And it'll have these split ends. And it'll look scraggly. It doesn't look good. It's not good to wash your beard every, you know, every day. And then use conditioner instead of 
uh, regular shampoo. There's beard washes out there that have like a conditioner in them. Um, that's the only products I use for beard. Other than that, I really don't. So, again, hey, if you have a product out there you want to send me to do a review on, I'm willing to do that. But I'm going to do an honest review because it's not a paid review. And if I like it, I will promote the product. So, anyhow, you can email me, jdwilly 43 at gmail.com that's jdwilly43 at gmail.com if you have questions on beard how to grow it if you're having trouble trouble growing your beard getting the thickness you know and I shave here like I said every now and then I trim it down here this is naturally how the my beard grows if I straightened it my beard would be down to here I had the straightened beard look before you go back and look at some of my videos from last year and as I look back like I said, I'm embarrassed they even straightened my beard. I like the natural look. I'm a simple man. I don't wear a lot of product. I don't wear cologne. I don't wear deodorant. You know, I just go natural. And that's the way I like to do it. I like to keep it simple. Anyhow, I hope that was helpful. If you have any other questions, like I said, email me. And I will get back to you. Or comment below. And I'll get back to you. Have a great day, everybody.